right, egg check. I've been waiting on these, still not eating Enzo. Oh, 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 that might be a pip right there. It is, aw, those snakes are hatching. All right, so these are pipping for another video. Okay. And, oh, oh, that's a super conda. Just casually sitting, who's it? Oh, no. oh my gosh. Oh, hi! Cute one. Hi, little superconda! Uh, I like the stripe. I guess these hobnoses are hatching! Well, let's take a closer look at you. Yeah, you have a beautiful stripe. Hi, cutie! Aww! Are you so scary? Oh, what a scary hognose snake. Yes, I'm very intimidated. Look at your cute little face. Hi. Man, and that stripe is really pretty too. Oh wow, the first baby out from this clutch is a super conda. That is crazy. Sorry, I just shut the door because I didn't want to let all the air out. Hi, sassy pants. Oh my gosh. You're denting. You've got to be getting close. You look good. You're denting, denting. Yeah, so denting means that they are getting really close to hatching. This is our video game clutch, and the pair was Omnomlet, and she was paired with Bra, which is a conda, and she was drop or er, paired with Dropkick Murphy, which is not a conda. And since the first baby is a super conda, that tells us that Bra is the dad. So we'll introduce you or show you him later. And I think we're gonna give these eggs a little bit of time to pip if they want to. And then tomorrow we will come back and cut them all open to help the unhatched ones out. All right, it is time to cut these eggs. I will admit, I never put a date on the lid, so I forgot when they were laid. And it did kind of take me by surprise to see a baby super conda or a baby yeah. at all. But I checked them every day because I never knew, I didn't know what it was gonna be. Well, also the weird thing is usually one pips, then others pip, yeah. and then a couple days later, one's out of the egg. But not in this one. In this case. Look at him. Oh, oh there's, there's nice another one. Aw, oh, it's a cutie. Oh, look at your little face sticking out. Aw, <laughs> hi little dude. What are you doing? What in the world's going on? Look at you. Bop, 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 bop. Oh my gosh. But still, this one. Overachiever much? Yeah, yeah, you're He's out. out. He's shed. Yeah, look at that. I can help you finish your first shed. We'll just go like this. Because Hognoses shed immediately out of the egg, which is kind of cool. Oh, Ta-da! First shed complete! And the other ones haven't even, like, these two have dented and he's pipped. Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, some of us are just sleeping in, I yeah. think. But we're gonna wake them all up, aren't we? You have such a pretty stripe. Yeah. Yeah, so she, is this one Super a girl? dark colors. Uh, I don't know if this was a girl or a boy. Mm. That's tough. I'd say boy. Huh, it's funny. I was thinking girl. But I don't know. We'll take a closer look later. Yep. You are very cute. And because of the pairing, now we know that both parents were condas since they made a super conda. Yeah. All of these babies now, a quarter of them will be normal, so they'll have a lot of little spots. Uh, half of them will be condas, so they'll have fewer but larger spots and possibly all black bellies. And the remaining quarter will be super condas. So you being the first one out, you had a 25% chance of being a super, and you were a super! Oh, look at that black belly! Beautiful, and they also- Stop looking at my belly! <laughs> both the condas and the super condas have uh, these white walls uh, al alongside each, yep. alongside the belly, and yeah, so it's basically the conda gene is a patternless gene. Is this our, is this our video game clutch? Yeah, yeah it oh, is! Okay. Oh, you tucked back in! <laughs> oh my gosh! No, I'm not ready to come out! <laughs> oh, wait, you need to see that up close! Oh my gosh, that is stinking cute. Look at him. What are you doing? He has come a out already. really dark head oh. stamp. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't you touch me. I'm sorry. Okay, let's move you into the timeout bin and then you won't be in the way. Yep. Okay. All right, let's yeah. cut these eggs open. We'll start with portal. All right. This might be the biggest egg in here. So come on, super conda. Come on, twins. Oh my gosh, <laughs> that'd be so cool. Oh, goop looks good. Okay. Oh, that's right. We just cut a bunch of bull snake eggs and these are gonna be the exact opposite. Yeah, bull snake eggs have such like calcified shells. These are such paper thin shells. It makes them really tough to cut, but that's all right. We'll get there. We have a nice sharp blade here. Okay, portal baby is alive. Looks good. That's good. Oh, oh I, I see some spots. I think it's con. I, ooh, that's a tough one to tell. Yeah. That one might be a normal. Might be normal. Next is angry birds. We'll do the angry bird. Are you gonna be an angry baby? 
Of course. Probably. A lot of babies are. Okay, that looks good. As long as they're healthy, that's all I really care yep. about. Okay, that's probably enough. Yeah, this baby is normal. <laughs> normal. Lots hooray. of spots there. <laughs> Man, for each egg having a 25% chance of being normal, we have two normals <laughs> already. Right yeah. <laughs> okay. Who's this one, Emily? Assassin's Creed, right? Yeah. yeah. Tried to call you out on it. I knew what I it was. You've never played that game before. I play it all the time. Um, no, yeah, sure. When? Uh, when what's, you're. What's the premise of the game? You kill a bunch of people. Yeah. Why? You don't. Need, you, I don't want to give away the game. Sure. Spoilers. <laughs> that would ruin the storyline. Okay. Assassin's Creed baby is. Super oh, Condor! Nice. Another good looking Super Yeah, Condor. no spots at all there. Wow. That's crazy. Okay, so the first four eggs that we open or open themselves, except for you, I don't know what you are. <laughs> Normal and Super Conda. Yeah. <laughs> no Condas yet. No Condas. That's crazy. I say that, crazy. No, all the rest are going to be Condas. Yeah, they're all going to be exactly. Okay, Zelda baby. wonder what this must look like to a baby hognose on the inside. Like, oh no, a blade in my face. That's okay. We're careful. Yeah. Okay. Zelda baby is a normal. Oh, There's yep. a lot of spots there. Okay, a little normal. Then we have Sims. Oh yeah. What do you think Sims baby is gonna be? I mean, the odds are, you always take the best odds. I'm gonna assume Conda. That's what I was thinking too. Let's see if we're both right or both wrong. Oh, Goop is like cloudy yellow. Yeah, we've had a lot of that this year. Yeah. Not a lot, but enough that they look fine. So. Yeah, as long as it's not red. Yeah. Like cloudy red. That's not a good sign. This might be okay though. All right. Sims baby is uh, normal. No. Oh my gosh. Why are there no condoms? <laughs> oh okay, my just gosh. Do, okay, now do three supers. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, this is crazy. I can feel the baby in here. Okay, new. Because it's so deflated. Did he pop it himself? Or? Uh, no, it's just really deflated for oh, some reason. I've never seen one this deflated before. So we're just going to like cut it like this. Because I can. Pinch and cut. Oh. Yep. Okay. This baby is. That looked like a conda. That looks like a conda. There we go. Finally. Okay, so what we're looking for is fewer and sp oh. more spread out. Oh, wait. Maybe not. Oh. No, that does look That looks bad. like a normal. <laughs> Why are there no condas? Okay, yep, a normal. How about N64 controller? Will Super. you. Super. Yeah, come on, Super Conda. Oh, we should have done Super Nintendo, because then we could have been like Super Conda. Oh, that would have been perfect. N64 controller is... Oh, that looks that's Conda. That's a Conda, yeah. Yep, look at that big spot with a lot of space around it. Yeah, that's a Conda. Yeah, there we go. Finally. Finally. Oh my gosh. So four, su four normals, two Supers, one Conda. Yep. And an unknown. And a face. Oh, a face. are you, are you going to come out? Are you saying you hello? To, you want to show us what you are? Can we see? Your head stamp does it. All, all three of the morphs have the same head stamp, so we we don't know what you are. Bok, 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 bok. No, that's just going to make you tuck in, if anything. Yeah. You are super cute. Yeah, yes. Okay, let's see. That one hatched. So, super. this is Gauntlet. Gauntlet was the first super. Oh, nice. Best game for the best snake in the clutch. Uh -huh. let's awesome. Let's do the ghost trims, Pac-Man. Okay. Oh, we did two Pac-Mans here. Yeah, we did. Yeah, two characters from it. Oh, that's right. We put your uh, parents' favorite games next to each other. Oh, yeah. Galaga for your dad, Pac-Man for yep. your mom. So we'll cut those last. I'm going to go with Super Conda. I am, too. I'm going to have high hopes. This is going to be a super. Oh, all I see is, a, is black. Got a little bit more. Okay, this baby is? Uh, normal. Uh, normal. <laughs> <laughs> Looks healthy, though. Yeah. Okay. Why couldn't we have the odds flipped? Like, why can't all the normals be supers? Yeah, wait a second. If we're hitting those I mean, odds. Maybe some of these normals might be low expression condas. Too, That's, so. there is that chance, yeah. So we'll count what we have, what we think we have. Yep. And then when we're out, we'll know for sure. And we'll see how close we are just by peeking in the eggs. Grunt from Halo. Yep, Halo Grunt is a normal. Oh, why are there so many <laughs> normals? Okay, Toad, be a super. Come on, be a super conda. You know they're like, ah, oh, it's a nice warm, like balloon feeling in here. <laughs> and then, and then welcome we reach to in. the cruel world. Yeah. Toad is normal. A normal. Oh, that might be a conda. Those, there was less spots. Maybe I think that's, that's a conda. normal. There's a lot of spots there. There's a lot, but I've seen there be a lot of spots on condas. Please, one of these three, be a super. Please, we could use another one. All right. Yeah, for the how many rupee. eggs there are? There better be yeah. super in here. Yeah. Each egg has a 25% chance of being super, and then we have two. That's okay though. This one is. I can't tell. I can only see belly. Oh, 
Conda. You think that's a conda? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I think that might be a conda as well. Okay, like a low expression yep. conda. Conda, better than a normal. <laughs> okay, so I think what we should do for these last two okay. is whichever one is the better morph wins. Like between your dad oh, and your okay. mom. Whoever they win the better video game. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Well, they. Oh, I see. Yeah, I just meant like who's our favorite parent oh, between the two of them. You're going deep. Right. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's you do. You can do that. I'm not gonna do that. My mom watches these videos. <laughs> oh shoot. Yeah, she does. <laughs> okay. Well, maybe we won't do that then. I'll just do who's the, who has the who's better video the game better choice. video game, Pac-Man or Galaga. It all depends on the morph inside. Yeah. Okay. That's what we'll do. I mean, I have a strong preference on one of these video games over the other because yeah. I think one of them is kind of boring. But. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Galaga. Come on, come on, you are conda? a conda, yeah, conda, I think. You're right in the middle, okay, a conda. All well, right. So both gonna be condas. Yeah, now we'll hit the odds. Okay, here are the opposite odds of Pac-Man. Okay, if this is a better game, it'll be a super conda. Yep. If it's just a normal, then Galaga is the better game. Again, we try to say this every time we're cutting, Red is not bad. Nope. Red is from the veins on the inside of the shell that deliver oxygen to the baby. It is perfectly fine. Yep. Yep, they not cut cutting the baby. They when they cut themselves out. Exactly. Let's figure this out once and for all. Pac-Man is... A normal? Not a super, but is it a conda? Oh, oh it might be a conda. That's a conda! Alright. Okay, they are equally good games. Ah, oh, okay, we will never know which is the better game. <laughs> well... We all know which one's the better we game. We all know which one's actually the it's better game. It's your choice. Uh, yeah, let us know in the comments which one is better, because obviously the hognoses can't decide. Yep. All right, well, we, we have two supers. a total of two out of a clutch of well, two. Well, maybe, first, well, yeah, I don't know. Maybe a third. Oh, that's true. The one poking the head out, we don't know what that one is yet. But out of 15 eggs, we should have, you know, about four supers. We have two. Yeah. <laughs> that's okay, though. But somehow we got two, So four, many normals! Six, eight, eight normals? <laughs> Why are there so many normals? Ah, oh, that's okay. Yep. Unless we have some sort of like split dad going on because we paired Omnomlet to Bra, and these two are both Kondas. So to make a super Konda, Bra would have to be the dad of those at least. Yeah. Because we paired her to Dropkick Murphy, who's a normal, and if he was the dad, yeah, then there'd be, split the there'd be more normals yeah. if he was the dad. So maybe it's a 50 50 clutch with the dads. Yep. But that's In all right. In this case, we got pretty good odds on those super Kondas. Yeah, that's true. So, there we go. Last one will be that guy. So I guess when they're all out, we will come back. Oh, he's so upset. Oh, sorry. Yeah, you're not gonna be the only one out anymore soon. <laughs> oh, little hiss. Oh, you're so scary. I love the tail curl. Yeah. That's my favorite part. But if we come back and there's three supers, yeah, we then we know what that is. That guy. Yeah. And this guy. <laughs> you are so sassy, oh my gosh. All right, we'll come back when they're all out. The babies are out. We've been gone for a little bit because of the Schomburg show, but that just gave them more time to all come out of the eggs. Yeah. So we have not looked at these yet other than seeing just a mass of babies through the plastic. So let's see. So many babies. Yeah, I, th I think they're all out anyway. So I guess, I guess first we're gonna see if they're out, then we're gonna see if they're healthy, then we're gonna see if they're morphs or what their morphs are. So yeah. we might notice the morphs first though, I guess. <laughs> let's find out. All right, so we know there's two super condas, maybe a third, because the one's head was only poking out. Let's Let's see. I one, see one two. two. Okay, so there are two super condas. Oh, are you guys already digging? Aww, look at you go. Oh, I wonder if we're gonna have any drama queens. Let's see, we have a nice conda here. Yep. Look at you, you look nice and healthy. Okay. We have, ooh, a really pretty little normal here. You're teeny. We have- A burrowing conda. A burrowing conda here. Look at you. Oh, you just want to take off? Oh, he's got like a bow tie right there. Yeah. That's cute. Okay, bow tie baby goes over there. A normal. You're a nice size normal. Mm -hmm. You look good. Are you a boy or a girl? You are a boy. Look at that long tail. Oh, yeah. Whoa, totally a boy. Okay. Here's a nice normal. Yep. Oh. I like his little curly tail. Yeah, I just noticed that too. Aww. Oh, can you curl it again? No, like, no. no. Nick, okay, not anymore. <laughs> really busy pattern on mm -hmm. that one. Like you have so many spots, holy cow. Here's a good opportunity to show you the difference between a normal, a conda, and a su- Oh, wait, wait, come back. There super we go. Conda. And a super conda. 
Nice, can you guys sit still a little bit? No. So basically the superconda gene, as you can see, is really just a patternless gene. And when it's partially being expressed, it slightly reduces the pattern. And that's what we call conda. And then when they have both copies of the gene, so the patternless gene from mom and dad, then it removes all the pattern altogether and they visually express that patternless gene completely. And that's how you get superconda. So and because of this, if anybody tries to sell you a het conda thing, it's not a thing. That is fake. Yep. We have heard that before that somebody was sold a het conda and it's like, Ooh, yeah, that's not uh, expressive or not. Yeah, Sorry. you either see it or you don't. So this normal, we know because of how the conda gene works, is just normal. Yep, There's no head conda. Nope, no, <laughs> no head conda, no conda in him at all. No patternless, no super conda, no conda. He is just normal. If he had any of the other things, he would show it vis v Aww. visually. Look, that one's hiding. The others. Wait, which one? Oh, <laughs> come here, see me, guys. What are you? I think you are a conda. Yeah, look at that. Aww. Let's see if you have a black belly like condas do. Oh, I'm mostly black, black belly. Yeah. And the beautiful white walls along the side of the belly too. You're really tolerant of me holding you. <laughs> He's like, pull me back. You like, don't care. Okay, here you go. Ooh, that's really pretty. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's no morphs or anything. That just shows you the variation of normal snakes or wild type snakes. Yeah. That is cool. Okay, normals. Oh, I think you're a new one. Oh wait, we only have one condo over there. So that means we're gonna repick some. You're super cute. I don't know if we saw you yet or not, but you're really cute. You're a conda. There's a conda. Whoa, look at the difference between these super condas. One has a stripe and one is One's completely like clean. Oh, yeah, that's, cool. that's really pretty. Oh, his face is weird looking. Yeah, they have different head stamps too. Does like he this. Have eyes? Yeah, he does. Okay. <laughs> does he have eyes? Yeah, that sometimes can happen. Super light wow. coloration compared to the other one. Yeah, look at all the design this one's got going on his head. Really pretty. Just variations in super contests mm -hmm. too. Okay. Let's give me a quick. Uh... Are you going to look underneath? There's another oh, underneath. I see a Two bellies, not three bellies underneath. So there's three that are also buried. <laughs> okay, let's uh, take these babies there. out that are on the yeah. surface. We can separate them into segregation now. Oh, perfect, All okay. Right. Okay, so we have normal, conda, super conda. Perfect. Here's, ooh, this one's kind of like a reddish colored conda. You're really pretty. Okay, right here. Hi, right. cutie, right, look at you. Oh, look at that black belly. Uh, there are three more, at least three more hidden in here. And so. you have to dig to find them. Baby hog noses, where might you be? Oh, there's one. Aha! I found a conda. <laughs> yes, you thought you were hiding. Do, 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 do. You're so cute. Just goes to show, as soon as they're out of the egg, their like instinct is to go down. Yeah, right. So good luck finding babies. Yeah, you have to dig. Don't throw out your perlite until you have gone through it all. Or you just know how many eggs you had. And then you oh yeah. Know, that also works. Well, what if you get twins? That's true. You never know. That looks like a conda to me. Yes, it does. Oh, you're really pretty. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. This one has a stripe down its whoa. back. Oh, oh, that one might be a keeper. That's really pretty. Really boy. I don't know, are you a? Girl. You're a, oh yeah, you, you've gotta be a girl. Yeah, that's a short tail. Well. Well, we're keeping her. <laughs> you're staying with snake discovery. Wow, you're so pretty. Okay, you can still go with the condas though. Oh, there's another one. Hi, baby. Oh, another conda. What, so all the condas are burying themselves. All the condas are like, eh. Yeah. Hide. What's kind of interesting here is with how the patternless gene works, we should have had, um, let's see, we did conda to conda. Should have had 25% normal, 50% condas, and 25% Super conda. So with 15 eggs, we should have had three, maybe a fourth super conda, and we should have only had three to four normals. Yeah. We have a lot more normals than that. Yeah, we guess. have two, three, four, five, six, seven normals, seven. almost twice is what we should have gotten. And we should have had a seven, eight, seven to eight condas. One, two, three, four, five, six. So a little shy of the condas, yep. a little extra on the normal, and we did get shorted on supers, but that's okay. It yeah. just shows you that you can't control nature. Yeah, you can You can get a best guess. Yeah. There's a 25% chance doesn't mean you're actually gonna get 25%. Exactly, yeah, it has worked out like right on the nose, like to the ratios that we were expecting. We got that in our babies before, like with the lavenders, we had 50% lavender, 50% normal, like we were expecting, but sometimes that doesn't happen. So we're just happy that all these babies look really healthy. So we're gonna set them up in baby bins. So you guys all know kind of how we set up baby bins. I'm just gonna share with you a few of the differences. 
I make with hog noses compared to other babies like bull snakes and fox snakes. And it has to do with their behaviors and their size. So like the other snakes, we have a paper towel at the bottom and I missed, lightly missed the paper towel. I do feel bad that they don't have the ability to burrow, but the paper towels are still, I think, worthwhile to have right now because it makes feeding them easier and safer. They're less likely to ingest bedding when they have paper towels also while they're eating. Also monitor their poop. Yep, we can monitor their droppings. Exactly, it's a lot easier to drop feed and et cetera, et cetera. So one of the differences is we have smaller caves in the back because the back is the heated end, which means that has to get turned around. So the back is the heated end. We use smaller caves back here. We also like to use caves that, I mean, this is a 3D printed cave that has a, 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 a topper to it, but instead of using it as it's supposed to be, we like to take each part separately and lay them like this because hog noses like to be crammed into things. So this they actually feel more secure in. Uh, another thing we do differently is their water dish. We have be, uh, quite a bit more shallow than the water dishes, the PVC caps that we use for the bull snakes. And this just helps them find their water a little bit easier. They don't have to climb as high up as they would on a PVC cap. So it makes easier, or it makes water easier for them to find. Like the other snakes, we still add a rock or something rough to rub on. If we have extra, we might add a second thing. And I especially like to add a second thing for hog noses, as well as extra enrichment for them, like fake plants, fake flowers, so on and so forth. And I add a lot more to the hog nose bins because they can be picky eaters and they seem to like it to be a little bit more crowded so they feel more secure. I think this has to do with something with why they seem to eat better for us as babies when they're kept with multiple babies. They're not kept alone. I think they feel more comforted or for, more safe. They're so squished up against their siblings. Yeah, exactly. So we're gonna do the same thing here. We're gonna get the others set up and then come back and I'll show you how we're going to arrange them so that feeding charts are easier to follow. Ta-da, baby bins with lots of clutter. And the way we like to separate these so that we have an easier time knowing who's eating, we're going to mix up the morphs. We're not gonna put the supers together even though you can tell these two apart. We're still gonna separate them like this and we're going to try to separate the condas as much as we can into separate bins. Uh, how many do we have again? There's a conda, Seven conda, condas, conda, one more conda. Well, that's a really pretty, that's okay. a pretty one. Okay, so, so you can tell these two apart because the one has a- dark. Yep, okay. And then all the normals, I mean, we can put a normal in each. Yep. Basically, we try to separate all the morphs so that when we are feeding them and we have a feeding card on the front, we can mark Superconda 8 or all of them ate, which is ideally what we want to do. Then it's easy. Then all of them had eaten um, when you attempted to feed them. Um, but more often than not, one will eat and two won't or two do and one doesn't. So you need a way to easily write down how the feeding day went. So yep. we just separate the morphs. So, oh, Conda 8 or all but the Conda 8, yep. you know. So that's how we do it here at Snake Discovery. It seems to make it a little bit easier. For the ones that are going to be like, we have two normals in here. We'll probably said, say a uh, red-headed normal eight yep. and that's how we'll differentiate them so should we put them in the baby rack sure do you want to see how the lavender babies are doing sure hey we're here past 10. it's yep. dark lights off that's all right babies i'll get them a feeding card and water in their water dish uh, right after this babies oh thank you there we go babies babies Hooray! are done Okay, before we check on Omnomelet and tell her what a great job she did having her babies, I wanna give you a quick update on our lavenders. Aww. So this bin has the striped conda baby, that's het lavender that we kept. And that behind him is the pinkish colored lavender, I believe. Yep, that's the pink one. Look how pretty that is. Oh my gosh. And they're all eating unscented. Oh, we have two in it? Uh, no, there's a third somewhere. Oh, it's Let's probably see. under the paper towel. Yep, I think it's, yep, right there. <laughs> Come here, little the baby lavender. From the pinkies. Oh yeah, that's from the pinky mice I uh, fed today. I had to like cut oh, the wow, heads that's off. That's like a really gray one. Yeah, so we've got like a silvery lavender and a pink lavender. Wow. I am so excited for the. Oh, sorry, <laughs> sorry. I am so excited for these babies. Look at all of them. Yeah, and this is only like a few of what we're keeping. We're and this keeping... explains, you know, gray lavender eight, pink lavender eight. And straight normal eight. Yep. So yep, that's how we can tell them apart. Right there. Oh, I have to clean that poop. Look Which at that. Means they're eating. They are. That's true. Yeah, these guys took the lavenders. Are like all eating, unscented, frozen, thawed. I haven't had to do any special tricks to get them to eat. They should be ready to go. And I think I'm gonna have already reached out to the waiting list by the time this video oh, yeah. comes out. So they are. This video is like a month from now. So yeah, probably. All these will be sold. The ones that are sell eventually up here. 
Those are all be gone by Probably. the time this video comes out. Yeah. Well, I think we should go say good job to Omnomelet. All right. All right, now put your finger there. That hole right there, just put your finger in there. Come on, put your finger in. No. Wait, is Omnom the one that comes out like... Yeah, okay. yeah. She is the crazy eater. Hi, Hi Omnomelet. Oh, don't you flatten out at us. Oh. What are you doing? You never do that. Hi, I'm Mom. It's okay. <laughs> She's yeah. like, oh, I'll oh, show you. Yep, there we go. Your now food? She, now she wants to eat me. Hi, Omnom. Your baby's hatched, and they're very pretty. Hi. Yes, you're very pretty, too. Just like your babies. Oh. She is following my hand. You want to eat me? Okay, well, let's take you out. Yeah, just pick her up, she'll get out of it. So, Omnomelet, your baby's turned out great. You threw a lot of normals, but yeah. that's okay. Do better next year, yeah. please. Can you send more super, you know what, she yeah. probably ate the super conda eggs. That's true, she probably did. <laughs> we do know your taste. Like, these are the expensive ones. My tastes are expensive. Nature told me to eat the children. <laughs> <laughs> I think somebody recommended that as a shirt. Oh, really? Nature told me to eat the children or eat the babies. <laughs> nice. And a picture of Omnomelet on there. <laughs> but she did not eat her babies this year, which we are so thankful for. Oh, look how sad Jester is. He's like, I didn't get to breed this year, guys. Oh, no, we didn't. Look at me. I'm so cute. You should have bred me. Sorry, you're a <sighs> teaching animal. <laughs> is he just, oh, he's had albino. He's we had albino. albinos from him. We could, yeah, I suppose. But we have so many other albino things. He's just our ambassador hognose <laughs> we bring true. with us. We probably shouldn't bring, like, fancy genetic morph hognoses, even a head albino, but... Oh. Look at that, what you doing? Oh my God, <laughs> what is that face for? Is this what you do at night when we're at home? You just creepily stare out into the distance and push all your bedding to the yeah. back? Okay, he's sorry. He's renovating. I guess, yeah, he's an architect. You know, or... he's depressed. He's he's moving his things around so he makes himself happier. Look at that Aww. face. That is a really <laughs> cute face. Oh my god, that's a good way to end this video. Yep. All right, perfect. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you so much, Patreon backers, because you allow us to do so much with spoiling our baby snakes and providing all the food for their hungry, hungry mouths uh, coming up here pretty soon. <laughs> She's like, I am my own pillow. <laughs> She's ready for bed. Are you ready Aww. to go to sleep? Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Thank you, Omnomelet, for your amazing babies. <laughs>